South Africa's anti-apartheid heroine Winnie Mandela has died at the age of 81. A family spokesman said she died peacefully on Monday, surrounded by her family and loved ones after a long illness. Winnie was the former wife of South Africa's first black president, Nelson Mandela. My husband has been fighting for the liberation of the African people. During his 27-year incarceration, she campaigned tirelessly for his release. They were famously pictured hand in hand the moment he left prison. In subsequent years, that picture changed. Pretoria has failed to rule our country. Both were anti-apartheid activists, but while Nelson campaigned for reconciliation with the white oppressors, Winnie built a reputation as a fighter against them. Her uncompromising methods contrasted sharply with her husband as he worked to forge a stable democracy. It killed their marriage and often landed her in the spotlight for the wrong reasons. While she had been hailed as the mother of the new South Africa, later years saw her reputation tainted legally and politically. She was sacked from her ex-husband's government for corruption alongside tales of glamorous living. In later years, she described her marriage to Mandela as a sham and that her true marriage was to her political party, the ANC, calling it the best marriage she'd ever had.